Hey guys, <clears throat> so I've been planning on doing this lifestyle for some time now. Well, ever since I bought my camper back in Seattle, which was six years ago. Uh, which the camper broke down in Nebraska, and I ended up getting a job here, and then a bunch of stuff fell apart. But uh, I'm finally able to get back to doing this. But I knew if I wanted to live on the road that I needed a job that I could do on the road. And so one of my favorite hobbies was metal detecting. I loved coins. I was so into coins. Um, <clears throat> and then uh, one day I saw hobo nickels on, on uh, eBay and started uh, carving coins. And uh, I've been doing this for about two and a half years. I got a page on Facebook, Deadhead Hobo Coins. That's the name of my business. Uh, now that I came up with High Dollar Hobo for the channel, uh, for the YouTube channel, I'm thinking about switching my coin carving business name to High Dollar Hobo. I do like Deadhead Hobo Coins, but I don't know, I feel like it's something that needs updated. I'll show you guys, uh, well, I brought something with me I got on eBay right now, and that's this beauty, and you're probably not going to be able to see it on camera. <clears throat> try to give you a good view but I'll, uh, I'll 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 do some pictures for you guys uh, but yeah that's that's a pocket watch with one of my carved coins inside and I learned how to do that because of a guy I saw making some other art so I mean I usually just carve coins but I started getting into this this resin art here which is really cool uh, so this is on this is on eBay right now if you guys would like to check it out one thing about my channel is I'm I'm not gonna ask for donations I'm not gonna ask for any donations I really don't want that uh, I but I would I will ask you guys to uh, look at my coins and to bid on them if you like them because that's how I make money and right now I'm kinda stalling with my van stuff because I gotta make money so I gotta work I, I this coin business I'm doing is a full-time job I talk to customers all day long I uh, do custom coins and I gotta keep coins up on my eBay page but yeah it, it, it is a full-time job but I really do enjoy it and I really do love it and I think it's, it will be just a great way to make a living on the road and be able to see the things I want to see and go to the places I want to go. And I'll be bringing my dog with me. I can hear her out there. I just came down here because I want to do a couple videos for the van. Uh, so that's that's my job. That's what I do for work. And I'll 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 throw in a couple pictures so you can so you can see my Facebook page and my. Uh, my eBay page and I'll leave links to those in the comments for you guys and let me know what you think about changing the name of my business to high dollar hobo okay so here's my uh, <clears throat> box of Sega stuff <sighs> really dusty but I got a doom for the 32x so I want to hook that up kind of and see how that works with my solar and stuff. I want to show you guys these uh, hooks I picked up at the dollar store. Uh, really cool. I thought that they would be great for the van life. Well, anybody with windows or... And see, one already fell down. Kinda... I hope they stay up. Yeah, so this little van upgrade. Got two bigger ones there. I don't know what I'll be hanging from them or where I'm going to put them, but I'm sure that they'll come in handy. Uh, I'm still waiting on an inverter. Uh, honestly, I just don't have the money to buy it right now. So that's why I want you guys to check out my coin page and see what you guys think about People that. People might want to know if the coin carving is illegal uh, because... But the, it's, the art's not illegal. The only way that it's illegal is if you, um, if say I took one of the legs off a buffalo nickel 
and made it a three-legged buffalo nickel and tried to sell it as a three-legged buffalo nickel. So that would be fraud. But what I'm doing is nothing different than like what a penny smashing machine does. You know, that machine smashes the currency and makes it into art. But yeah, you can, if you guys are questioning about that, you can look it up. It's not illegal. A lot of people do it. Uh, it's a good hobby. It's a lot of fun. And I never carve expensive coins or rare coins. I only carve coins that there was millions and millions of them made. So, so that's my van video um, for today. Uh, there, there comes Sassy. Hey, Sassy. You find anything? You are all dirty. That's not good. Alright, well, thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Bye.